Additionally, in, in, in my space, which is in scaled education as part of a marketing function, um, most of the metrics that have been used to measure success are literally 40 years old. I had a marketing leader one day say to me, oh, we can't measure that. Eh, don't bother, we can't measure it, Anne. And that was really the impetus for me to say, well, of course we can measure it, there's gotta be a way. So we started with brand health. Um, we really wanted to see which, if any, of our brand health metrics were indicators or predictors of ad revenue. The first project that we did with analytic partners here gave us the opportunity to really test this out. Could we measure some of these really hard to measure channels? Earned media, right, press, conversation about your brand, all those types of things that aren't directly paid for, but that we all believe as researchers and marketers that have some impact. The work we've done in identifying the inferred causal relationships between, for example, paid, owned, and earned channel investments or channel strategies, and what those yield for us have absolutely informed how we have revised or optimized our strategy In fact, what it's helped us to do is to quantify the impact that our business marketing efforts have had on revenue, which is the, the holy grail of marketing, right? It's to prove out the ROI of the work that we're doing. The impact for us is to pull back and think more strategically about why we're making these investments and what should our long-term mix be. And I hope and I, and I do believe that that's what's been a key part of our success.